Good morning, passengers. This is your captain speaking. I'm begrudgingly required by my job to welcome you aboard. Our destination is the Heavy Hitters Festival. And listen, I gotta make this quick, as I just stole a cop's gun on a dare, and I've been informed he's making his way through TSA and the SOP is PO'd. A little about myself, my name is Spruce Neville. After I was let go from American Airlines for my third DUI, I applied at Awful Good Airways after I heard they don't conduct background checks. So I've done this a few times before, even if I do not currently have a license. What are you, what, what are you doing? Get out, get out of there. Our in-flight entertainment is this bouncy image of a plane, so please enjoy it for the next several hours. Brought to you by our friends at the Raccoon Society, which I imagine is a village where they have created their own form of language, trading, and government. A little reminder that since politicians continue to deny global warming, please refrain from getting too close to the windows as direct sunlight can broil you into the debris at the bottom of a grill after 4th of July. And I'm not talking beyond burgers. Take your own friggin' skittles, you Due to budget cuts, we can no longer provide water for this 12-hour flight and are limited to one airsick bag located in row 4, seat B, so please share generously. In the extremely likely event of emergency, please place your mask on your face first before placing one on your assigned birthday chimp. And don't forget to buckle up, as I like to fly a little dirty. After last year's spring break flight out of Tampa, the bathroom capacity has been reduced to two people maximum to prevent the spread of pink eye. Despite what the FDA says, I'll say that our freshly microwaved food is somewhat mostly edible. We ask that you applaud at the end of each performance, regardless if you liked it, as we will be keeping track of the non-clappers, and you will be asked to leave the plane mid-flight. So I hope you brought your own parachute. Also in the pocket in front of you is the safety guide. I've never read it personally, so if you find anything you'd like to bring to my attention, let me know after we land. Reminder to our air marshals to leave on their aviator sunglasses so we know who the bastards are during our flight. And now that we're locked and loaded, I can finally admit that for someone that showed up to flight class high every day, I'd say I'm doing a pretty small job for my first time in the cockpit, especially considering I later dropped out. At the end of the flight, I'll be collecting tips that I'll use to entice one of the spicy attendants for an evening of mojitos and mozzarella sticks at the nearest Chili's. See you heavy hitters at the after party. BYO Mod Sticks. Uh.